There are people out there who make hundreds of thousands of dollars selling logos on websites like Upwork, for example. The thing is that we have pretty advanced AI tools. Logo Diffusion is probably the best one because you have a lot of inbuilt features. Obviously, you can go from text to image, but you can also use your sketches to convert them into professional logos and then you can vectorize those images. So let's try it out. Now, since I'm into boxing and I wrote this article featuring boxing logos, let's design a logo for an imaginary boxing gym. So once you sign up, you're gonna get 40 credits to try it out. It's a paid tool, but I think it's really worth it. Now my prompt is boxing gym logo minimalist gloves American flag. Here you can select the style that you want and they have like 45 different styles. So in the logo design category, we have pictorial, mascot, badge, abstract, icon, line art, and they have also new in beta where you can even design logo types, but I'm just gonna stick with pictorial and hit generate. And there you go, we have some logos and we can tweak it in Illustrator. So I'm just gonna vectorize that and bring it to Illustrator and make it into a logo. Okay, so I got this vector in Illustrator now. First thing I want to do is I want to clean it up, right? I'm just going to lock the background and then I'm going to select this shape and I'm actually going to remove it all together. I'm going to also remove this watermark because what I can do is I can go to object offset path and do it this way. I think 10 is fine. So I'm just going to hit OK and I'm going to change the color to white. I'm going to bring it to back. And now I can remove this background actually and I can create my own background and then I'm going to create logo type, maybe like a hundred. I'm going to change the color to white and the name of our brand is just battle. I'm going to make it much bigger, position this in the center and then I can go here and switch it to optical and make it even tighter but with an exception to to this now it looks pretty much okay so i can create an outline and so i can position this in the center find the right you know spacing i think something like this is pretty good add the trademark symbol it's gonna make it look super cool so that's it for today i hope you enjoyed this video go ahead and experiment with logo diffusion find link in the description and follow for more tips on branding strategy and design and i will see you in the next video